Hey students, beautiful day, is everybody psyched about the field trip next week, the Residio? Interesting fact, the Residio was founded in 1876 when the Spanish made it the military center of their expansion. Dude, don't try to make our field trip all educational. Now I am going to collect your permission slips. Ugh, I think I left my permission slip at home. I remember it was in my hand when I went to get some orange juice this morning. Wow, at least I know it's in the fridge. Hey, it's Mr. McMilligan, no biggie. Uh, sorry Mr. McMilligan, but I forgot my permission slip. You forgot it? You forgot it. I guess what I do here isn't important. No biggie Mr. McMilligan, that's what you kids always say. Well guess what? It's a huge biggie. I can bring it in tomorrow? Oh, sure, tomorrow. That's what my girlfriend said too. I'll be back tomorrow to pack up my things. Okay, why don't I go get my permission slip? Here's what'll make me feel better. Never seeing any of you irresponsible ungrateful little twerps ever again. Wait, don't jump. Oh, who puts rose bushes outside of a window? Hey Dad, I'm trying to write a thousand word page about a hero. Today was one of the worst days ever. People accused me of getting rid of Mr. McMilligan. All I did was forget my permission slip. No reasonable person would ever blame me for this. You got rid of Mr. McMilligan? This is all your fault. Wait, how about Kayla fills in as a substitute for Mr. McMilligan? Absolutely not. Come on just do it. No. Why not? Rosie I said no and no means no, okay? I don't have time for this. Dad can you please talk to him? Hey, there is a $300 reward for anyone who fills in when a teacher is absent. Wait, seriously? Okay I'll do it. I wonder when our new teacher is going to get here. He's going to get here anytime soon. And don't worry, you're going to love him. Good day mates. Dude. What are you wearing? I'm dressing up like what a good teacher is supposed to dress up like, class. Do you know who I am? I used to rule this school back when I went here. Good times. Kalu, I know this may be fun for you, but it's not fun for us. Well, not yet. We haven't gotten to the good part. We'll be reenacting the moment I became the most respected kid at this school. Spitballs. How cliché is that? Hey, classics never go away. It's old school. I used to be the most respected guy at this school. What happened? If you want to be a good teacher, you need to let everyone know that you're in charge, and that you're the leader, and that you rule this school. I see what you mean. Instead of dressing up as a teacher, I should dress up as a prince. Oh boy, these kids are gonna tear you up. Take your seats everyone. And no talking. We're already in our seats, and no one was talking. Talking back. We'll talk after class. Wow, you're really taking control. I said no talking. But I was just telling you. Nobody cares about what you were telling me. You have detention after class. No, forget it. I didn't even do anything wrong. Thank you for coming in to discuss your daughter's behavioral issues. I'm ashamed of you Rosie, and pulling me away from work, I was on my lunch break. I can't believe today we're going to be stuck with Kalu. Not necessarily, I think I have a good way to get rid of Kalu. Alright, everybody, eyes forwards, mouth shut. Tomorrow is our field trip, so I'm going to need all the outstanding permission slips. Uh? I forgot mine again. You forgot it? You forgot it. As if my job isn't hard enough already. The system is broken. Classes are overcrowded. There's no resources and the coffee in the teacher's lounge is undrinkable. Well then why don't you just quit? I want my brother back. Who is with me? Let me rephrase. Who never wants to see Mr. Kalu again? Me. 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 See Kalu, they won't hold you back. Okay, I quit. So, 
Wanna do something after school today? After school? Sorry, I have somewhere to be. Another day. Stuck staring at the clock. I never should have tried to bring my brother on this block. I argued with the principal. I argued with the principal, and I did lose. Now I got the meanest, baddest, low-down detention blues.